narrow defeat today. What's your thoughts on the performance? Um, yeah, frustrating. We, we we defended so well at times, and I thought with an element of comfortable about it, to be honest with you. And then we had a spell where Mitch has pulled two great saves off. But if you look at the back, it's two mistakes from us that's led to the chances. And then if you let a six foot five centre off walking at the far post with a free header, he's going to score in this league every single time. And it's just that naivety. Um, so massively disappointed. I don't think we create enough for the other end of the pitch, especially first half. I don't think, I think barring Jaden's one that come off the post that was offside, I don't think we, we affected the penalty area at all. So we have got to get that end of the pitch right. It's just not fair on the, the lads at the back because they're within reason they're doing their job. Um, but and, we, and we're desperate to, to bring a couple in. That's what we're trying to do. But it's, it's just not easy to, to get them through the door. So um, until we until we improve that area of the pitch, we, uh, we, we're going to struggle to, to create chances because the boys are not, the boys are not, it's not fluid at the minute and it needs to be. So um, I, look, I think when you, when you come away from home, you know you're going to be up against it a little bit at times, but I didn't think we was up against it as much as what we could have been, and that makes it even more frustrating. You mentioned the boys about there. Obviously, Christian came in for George to start the game. Was that a tactical decision or injury decision? A little, a little bit of both. Um, George's foot's still sore. Obviously, he, he, he's still in and around it, but we've, we've got two games in three days. We need to, we need to make sure we manage because we, we haven't got high school players. So we've got to be sensible with what we're doing. Um, I think the young lads have done extremely well, but you can't we can't rely on them. And so we, we've got to work hard. Hopefully Mo, Mo will be back in the squad soon, but Monday will be too soon for him. And even if he is in the squad for Notts County, it's probably only going to be from the bench. So we've just got to, we've just got to keep working hard to see if we can get a couple over the line. Of course, Christian, that was his full debut, starting for the first time, and he did well on his first proper debut. Yeah, start. I, I think as I said, I think the defenders and, and, and Mitch today were excellent, and that's what made the, the corner even more disappointing because actually we didn't. We didn't do anything that would con condone that sort of goal. We, we, we weren't, it weren't like they was opening us up every five seconds. We, we defended really well. Um, as I said, we've got to be more effective in the final third. Going back on the first half quickly, obviously, as you mentioned, it showed our defensive solidity for the most part. And then, like you said, you, you know, not creating enough chances and you want to work on that. You know, how do we work on that? What's the plan moving forward with that? Um, obviously, we, we, we are working hard on it in the training ground, but I think it's about personnel as well. I think you need like, all due respect to Tommy and like he's, he's a young lad and we can't put the whole weight of our, our, our team on his shoulders and Corey's come in, he's, he's got to get used to the way we want to play and, and, and how we want to do things and the, the problem we've got is we've got two centre forwards with both flights going behind and we're, we're lacking that little bit of hold up play at times and look, it is what it is, but the credit to both lads, they've worked their socks off today and maybe when he came on worked his socks off, Ellis when he came on worked his socks off, can't fault their effort but we, we have got to have more quality in the final third. That's from everyone though, that's the delivery into the box, that's the midfielders joining the play. Um, we did, we caused problems from set pieces today and we never seem to land on that second ball, but we always seem to be the second best there. And I think that's an area we need to be better at as well. Of course, second half did see a bit of a momentum switch. You know, we did seem to be the team in the front foot looking to cause the opening goal of the game. And obviously, like, you know, kind of a big team against the with physical side. Defending for set pieces has got to be crucial, and like you said, you've got to be marking men. Yeah, we, 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 within reason, the game plan worked perfectly. We wanted to come here, we wanted to nullify the first half. They've just come off the back of the two new wins, so they're going to be quite buoyant. And actually, I, don't, don't, I know we had a few last ditch tackles in the first half, but really, they didn't cause loads. In fact, I thought it was a, knew it was a perfect result because neither team really had any clear chuck. Uh, clear cut chances, and then second half the game plan was let's come out front for let's get behind them, and we did that really well. And actually, I thought up until the, the, the goal, we were in control of the second half. Um, again, I don't think we created loads of chances, but at least we territorially, 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 we were in the right areas. Um, but then look, we know that the crossfield ball that tried to get played that gets cut out when we're open as we are can't happen, and then that's what leads to the corner, and then. It, as I said, you can't let five football in the far post on Mark because he's going to score over time. You mentioned naivety as well. Obviously, that comes with having a younger and smaller squad as well. But it's it's experiences that that we'll learn from and look to not happen again next this season. Yeah, look, we've got we, we know we've got a good platform to work on. We've just got to add those bits in the final third. That's what we've got to add, and that's what me and the staff have got to do. We've got to try and find those players. But it's not easy when you're trying to find players that they, they can't. They're going to have to be loans, and they can't cost us any money. And clubs 
are not overly keen on doing that at the minute because of obviously the financial situations involved. So we've got we've just got to keep going back to the drawing board, seeing where we can make make some moves and see if we can try and get some players through the door because we're desperate to get two or three more bodies in and and, and but our hands are tied a little bit. And of course that comes with the next game at home on Monday, Bank Holiday Monday against the Oval. Yeah, and look, I think they've they've had a they've had a defeat today and they've had a man sent off, so they're going to want to bounce back from that. And look, we if we can start creating chances, we we, we know we're going to win football matches because we're we, we're resolute at, at the back and we, we can keep teams at bay for large proportions of the game. We just need to make sure we're rewarding their efforts with some goals at the other end of the pitch, and that's got to come sooner rather than later. Are you in the shop? Sign up below. Click here for the next video and click here to subscribe. Stop.